Good morning, my name is Ralph Riggs. I'm an addiction recovery coach, a life coach, and author, and the host of this show, The Take Your Life Back Today radio show. Combined with the YouTube video version on channel, Take Your Life Back Today show on YouTube. Talking about drugs with kids in elementary school, ages 6 to 10. At the low end of this age range, children are very perceptive and anxious to learn. This is a good time to introduce more details into your conversations about drugs, especially what they need, uh, uh, what they need to know, and the consequences of using them. Explain the concept of addiction. That some people may not understand how harmful drugs really are, and that some people try drugs and then have a hard time quitting. Introduce them to the idea that drug use can lead to abuse, which can lead to addiction. Good drugs and bad drugs. There are both of them. Kids in this age group may ask why some drugs are good for you and others aren't. With the rise in prescription drug abuse, this is a good time to explain to them that um, prescription uh, medication should be uh, taken only when a doctor tells you to and only when administered by uh, an adult. Tell your child that bad drugs can make you sick or even kill you, and that is why it is wrong to take them, even once, not even try it. They may even understand that uh, sadness um, um, uh, uh, that comes with death if they have lost one, uh, a loved one such as a grandparent or an uncle and aunt that might have overdosed. Honesty and praise is on that list of mine. Explain in more detail how dangerous it is for children to drink alcohol and how harmful it is to their developing brain and body. Tell them the truth. Even relatively small amounts of alcohol can make a child sick. If your children aspire to, to like someone famous, such as a sports figure, remind them that it's uh, important to take uh, care of their body and not to use tobacco, alcohol, and or drugs if they want to excel. And you can also tell them to look into Tim Tebow, who's a Christian and a good role model. You need to repeat yourself. While in elementary school, children need to be warned about not using inhalants. Tell them repeatedly that even one instance of inhaling can lead to severe brain damage or even death. And when they ask, when children in this age group ask questions, it's often because of something uh, they have seen or even heard, and it's important to know where they are getting their information from. For an example, your eight-year-old may ask, what is pot? First, clarify to your child it means marijuana by asking where the child learned about it and what exactly was heard, read, or even seen. Based on uh, that, you might answer, it's a very dangerous drug that people smoke, usually like a cigarette butt, but sometimes in a pipe. Marijuana has chemicals in it that can cause cancer and maybe even kill you. People who smoke marijuana can get uh, addicted and can't stop using it, or they might try other very dangerous drugs, too. It's nothing to mess around with, you to remind them, and uh, I hope you don't ever try it. You're a smart girl, a smart boy, and I wouldn't want you to mess up your life. Um, always try to involve others uh, during uh, educating your children. Children this age still respect adults, particularly law enforcement. As your child enters elementary school, offer to help establish or administer a drug education pro program that includes outside resources. Always encourage healthy choices and smart decision making. Talk to your kids often about making good choices and about healthy living and smart goal setting. Let them make age-appropriate decisions and reward them when they do well. Doing so empowers them and gives them confidence in their decision-making skills. My friends, before leaving elementary school, your children should know the immediate effects of alcohol, tobacco, and drug use on different parts of their body, including the risks of coma or fatal overdoses. The long-term long consequences, how and why drugs can be addicting and make users lose control of their lives.
the reasons why drugs are especially dangerous for growing bodies. They should know this by the time they get out of school. The problems that alcohol and other illegal drugs cause not only to the user, but also the user's family and the world. Your kids should know these things by the time they get out of school, and if not, please reinforce it. Call me at 844-405-HELP. Together we can help each other take our lives back. Be good to yourselves. Be good to each other. And a simple smile to a total stranger can help that stranger for the rest of their life and can change your life as well. Teach your children about drug use, alcohol abuse, and the dangers and how it can change their lives forever or even take their